Ladies and gentlemen, signals the entry of the cadets onto the parade ground.
के सामने से गुजरे तब कृपया खड़े होकर तथा जो वर्दी में है वे सैल्यूट कर निशान को समुचित सम्मान प्रदान करें Gentlemen, the parade is now lined up for review. The cadet commanding today's parade is Academy Cadet Captain J S Suman. The officer on horseback to your extreme left is Lieutenant Colonel Gagandeep Singh, the Adjutant National Defence Academy. An alumnus of this academy, Lieutenant Colonel Gagandeep passed out from Charlie Squadron 93rd Corps. A second generation Guards officer. He was commissioned into the 11th Battalion of the Brigade of the Guards in December 1998. The officer has varied operational experience, which includes active service on the icy heights along the Chinese line of actual control and counter-terrorist operations in the northeast. He has held the prestigious appointment of weapons instructor at the Infantry School Mao from 2004 to 2006. wherein he was awarded the best instructor as an infantry officer he has the distinction of standing first in the prestigious battalion support weapons course at infantry school mao he is also a graduate of the defense services staff college 
He was posted as a military observer in a highly active sector in the United Nations mission in Congo prior to his present appointment. The officer was awarded General Officer Commanding in Chief Commendation Card in 2012. As regards the lineup of the squadrons on parade, the pride of place to lead the parade is always reserved for last term's champion squadron. In this term, it is November squadron standing right next to the adjutant. March to glory, our alumni have demonstrated exemplary courage and dedication both in war and peace. They have defended our borders, 
Wesh. the territorial waters paid for the nation and touched its sky with glory. A list of our alumni who have distinguished themselves in war would be like a veritable who's who of ancient heroes. I know what you're about. There are some who we always remember with special fondness. Captain Gurbatan Singh Salaria, Second Lieutenant Arun Khedrapal and Captain Manoj Kumar Pandey. All of whom showed extraordinary valor, daring, and determination of the highest order. Captain Salaria in Congo in 1961. Second Lieutenant Arun Khedrapal at Chakargarh in 1971. And Captain Manoj Kumar Pandey at Khalupar in 1999. All three were posthumously awarded India's highest gallantry award, the Param Veer Chakra. Their spirit and that of others who made the supreme sacrifice resides in the hut of remembrance behind the Sudan block, which was built brick by brick, stone by stone, with the dedicated toil of the cadets of the 10th to the 17th Gospel.
Academic Specialist Service Training, Outdoor Training exposed from an integral part of a cadet's routine in the Academy as they inculcate a sense of discipline and commitment in the budding soldier.
좋아하십니다. 
Gentlemen, as you look to the extreme left of the parade, you can see Division Cadet Captain Ravindra Yadav from November Squadron coming to hand over the Chiefs of Staff banner to the Academy so that it can now be presented to the squadron that has won the championship this term. It is on the basis of the squadron's collective performance during the course of the term in four key activities, namely academics, outdoor training, specialist service training and games that the championship is decided. <laughs> Earlier we had the Commandant's banner for the champion squadron. The Chiefs of Staff banner was instituted during autumn term 1980. Bravo squadron was the first to win it then. The reviewing officer will present medals to the award winners in a short while. Winners of awards of Spring Term 2013 are Winner of the President's Gold Medal, Academy Cadet Captain J.S. Suman. Winner of the Silver Medal, Squadron Cadet Captain Vikrant Kumar. Winner of the Bronze Medal, Academy Cadet Adjutant Vishal Daya. Winner of the Chiefs of Staff Banner, November Squadron. The President's Gold Medal is awarded every term to the cadet standing first in the overall order of merit of the passing out course. In determining the award, regard is paid to the cadet's academic achievement, performance in outdoor activities, and to his officer-like qualities throughout his stay in the academy. The silver and bronze medals are awarded to the cadets standing second and third in the overall order of merit of the passing out course. The Chiefs of Staff banner is awarded to the squadron standing first in the overall championship. The championship is decided on the basis of points gained by the squadron in the various inter-squadron competitions held during the term. Squadron Cadet Captain Rishabh Raj of November Squadron will receive the Chiefs of Staff banner.
for young men is evident as they march forward to receive their well-deserved award. The reviewing officer is now requested to present medals to the award winners and the Chief of Staff banner to the Champion Squadron of this term. Winner of the President's Gold Medal, Academy Cadet Captain J.S. Suman. Winner of the Silver Medal, Squadron Cadet Captain Vikrant Kumar. Winner of the Bronze Medal, Academy Cadet Adjutant Vishal Dahiya. Winner of the Chiefs of Staff Banner, November Squadron. इन कैडेटों ने न सिर्फ अपने स्क्वाडन का नाम गौरवान्वित किया है बल्कि अपने माता पिता का शीश भी ऊंचा कर दिया है नवंबर स्क्वाडन के कैडेटों के लिए भी यह अत्यंत हर्ष और उल्लास का समय है इन्होंने पढ़ाई शारीरिक प्रशिक्षण खेल कूद व कवायद जैसी गतिविधियों में अपनी महारत साबित कर चीफ सब स्टाफ के प्रतिष्ठित ध्वज को प्राप्त किया है चैंपियन स्क्वाडन होने के कारण नवम्बर स्क्वाडन के कैडेट अब दाहिने कंधे पर स्लंतक लगाने के साथ साथ अपने स्क्वाडन भवन के आगे दो समारोहिक तोपे भी रख सकते हैं साथ ही वे अपने स्क्वाडन भवन पर चीफ सब स्टाफ के प्रतिष्ठित ध्वज को पहरा भी सकते हैं The medal winners are marching back to take their position. It's indeed a proud moment for them as well as for all those who have been associated with their training here and of course for their parents. The cadets of November Squadron, it is also a special occasion as they have been declared the champion squadron and have received the prestigious Chiefs of Staff banner. The distinction of being the champion squadron entitles the squadron to put up the banner atop the squadron building next term. It also entitles the squadron to display two ceremonial guns at the entrance to the squadron, symbolizing their achievement. Ladies and gentlemen, in a short while, two super demonas will fly past over the quarter deck. Thank you. 